Good evening, everyone, and welcome to an ITSL game against Dan Miller. I played against Dan one time before. We played the last season in ITSL. Uh, defeated him in that game. I, uh, I was the USSR for that contest. And I'm going to be the USA for this one. Been looking forward to this game. I have five games left on my ITSL schedule. I'm 13-2. and two. If I win all five, then I uh, win my division. Get that coveted double bye in the playoffs. Um, that is going to be a tall order. I have uh, some tough games on my schedule. Um, obviously, first and foremost, Michael Stryker, uh, the leader of my division. And, uh, of course, Tim Furrow as well. Um, a great player in his own right who is very hungry for wins as well as he is fighting to try and make the playoffs uh, after some, some tough luck this year. So uh, it's going to take a lot of good luck uh, to win out um, and, uh, and win the division. But, um, you know, I would be happy to win three or four of these games and uh, equal or surpass my record from last season. I went uh, 16 and four in my debut ITSL season. And I hope I can get a little further in the playoffs than I did last year as well. Um, I did win one playoff series against Tomash. Uh, that was after getting a double bye. So made it to the conference quarterfinals. Um, or rather, yes, yes, the conference quarterfinals. Um, and then before I was swept out by David DiCarlo. So hoping I can make it a little bit further this time. But, uh, you know, a lot of work to do between now and then. Got a lot of games to win. And even if I don't win my division, I still would like to finish in those top handful of wild cards and get a single buy. And that is definitely important. So just waiting for Dan to accept, and then we will get underway. Dan confirmed today that he was available to play. So just waiting him, waiting for him to get online. If you are anxiously awaiting uh, some Twilight Struggle action, I encourage you to go check out J.R. Jones's Twilight Struggle game tonight. He's playing the same time I am. Uh, so uh, get, uh, get one of them up on your TV, another one up on your mobile device. Still waiting. And here we go. All right. Let's get some four ops, huh? Okay, got one. Got a four-up, got defectors. Europe scoring is nice. Uh, the Nazis are nice. So this is a clear defectors headline situation. Could set up 4-3-3 three, three, uh, with defectors, but, you know, I like setting up 4-4-2 four, four, kind of regardless. Um, you know, just don't, don't tip off that I'm going to headline defectors or anything else weird. Immediate defectors there. Decent ops here, not great. Seven, eight, 12, 13, 14, 15 ops uh, with Europe scoring. Yeah, not a not a high ops hand by any means. And uh, perhaps more problematic, I am not going to be able to play around blockade. So uh, I will almost certainly just event these guys. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this headlines Nasser. Perhaps expecting Middle East, given that I headlined so quickly. Um, but, you know, uh, Nasser is a fine target for defectors, even though I was hoping to hit Purge or if he was feeling frisky, even something like Decal. Bert the Turtle and the Nazis. And he's going to take a coup of uh, Ron, presumably. Oh, no! Oh, interesting. Goes for a big coup of Italy right away. Rolls a one, so it didn't matter where he went. All right. 
So now what the heck do I do? So my normal play here, which I think is going to be, I mean, I, I normally like to go into Asia here, um, even though I, I have Europe scoring, and I'm not going to be able to play around blockade using a three op there, but I think this is valuable enough uh, that I want to I wanna go ahead and do that. Gutsy play there, trying to big coup of Italy. With, with only a three op, needs a five to clean me out. Didn't get it. Another coup. Oh, and another one. Wow, really lucky. Okay, so now down to three, and his his cooing is, suggests to me that uh, he probably has decal because uh, he probably wouldn't be in such a hurry to get Defcon down so fast. So given the, I think he has decal. I think three France is fine, and then one Thailand is fine is fine as well. Um, Let's do that. I, I have the, Defcon is going to be Defcon's at three, so uh, and I have the war. So Pakistan's safe. I don't need to go into India right away. Then I am expecting D call here, and then the question becomes what I want to do about it. No, no D call. Interesting. Okay, two South Korea is a good play for him. Let's go ahead and dump the scoring. Get our get our five VPs. And you know what? That was a mistake. Uh, should have gone to space. That was already a mistake. Um, should have should have gone to space there. Oh, okay. So he's going to use Fidel presumably to take. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, threatening Pakistan like that. I have to do this. Okay. I definitely, I definitely should have spaced um, when he took when he put two in South Korea. To use the Nazis when he put two in South Korea. That was a mistake. So Olympics, Fidel down. Just use C five Korean War to take South Korea, presumably. Okay, to take my take away my domination, and then yeah, let's go ahead and. Get to space, and I'm leaving my mill ops for the last AR of the turn, which is very bad form. Um, so he could punish me for that as well. But it was important that I space. It was important that I filled France. All the stuff I did was important. So we'll see if he pokes West Germany, maybe pokes Iran here. With Middle East unscored. Oh, containment. That's what you're going to do. Yeah. Oh, he's got to take Middle East presence. That makes perfect sense. An interesting one Taiwan as well. All right. Uh, so I think giving up Romanian is fine here. Um, I want DEFCON to go down. I, I really want to get a third in Thailand. Um, but that's just not in the cards right now. Because uh, I need mill ops. Uh, and if DEFCON goes to four, Thailand's getting cooed anyway. So let's just take a coup. <laughs> Another one. Okay, so that's three coups, three ones. Although, um, certainly, those are certainly favorable results for me. Okay. He needs to not draw decal or Vietnam because Thailand is sitting very vulnerable. Okay, I get Vietnam, which is good. And then the question becomes what do I want to headline? Purge is the obvious choice, but yeah, yeah, I th I think it's gonna be purge. Yeah, I don't have. Uh, I don't. Want, uh, none of these other cards are worth headlining. Purge is fine. Yeah. Yep, and that's. Uh, I, I I left. Uh, I left Thailand at two, so. But okay, now now he's got a choice to make. If he takes Thailand, uh, then I can then I get a coup in Africa. 
So that's something. He may not take Thailand. He may just score Asia right away. That might be his play. I think we may see Asia scoring. No, nope. going to give Marshall and take Thailand. All right. It's a three in Southeast Asia. Also, the fact that he gave Marshall like that suggests to me, well, that he doesn't have... So Purge and U.S. Japan are in the dumpster. Um, new, uh, new Testament. So he doesn't have NATO. Doesn't have another four up. Uh, obviously, he does have the China card. And you know what? Now, if he's going to... He's just gonna he's just gonna dominate Asia, um, so I'm gonna just hope that he doesn't have it. And then let's get a coup in. Let's see if I can get a three and knock him out of Algeria. It would be real nice. <laughs> Another one. Okay. Uh, well, now it's hope he doesn't have Asia scoring time. Also, I have to probably hold on to NTB for blockade. Okay, so I have to worry about AI war. So my next priority is, media, is to expand out of Israel. Uh, AI war is a big, 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 big problem for me right now. Um, Diesel. Ugh. Okay. Yep, yeah, and he gets out of Romania and presumably Finland. Yep. Yeah. Three and Mexico. No, does not go into the bottom half of Africa. That's interesting. Okay, well, the question is, do I not play around blockade again? Because I want Lebanon, and I want Egypt, and I want to get one into Algeria or Mexico. I could also not go into Egypt. Five-year plan's still around. He could, could five-year plan Middle East. Let's do that. There's gonna be plenty of opportunities to realign Mexico. Playing fast and loose here with blockade. But I did not draw, I have not drawn a card that is suitable to discard with it. So, okay. Board doesn't look good uh, at the moment. Uh, you know, Europe looks good, Middle East looks good, but Asia is bad. EU going to space. All right, well, let's get one into Mexico, and then um, let's get one into India as well. Um, oh, you know what? Why, what am I doing? Lao is important here as well. So one here, and then, yeah, one in Lao is good. Maybe I can fight on country count there. I don't think he would have spaced if he had Asia scoring. But he is also so far ahead in Asia, he doesn't have to worry about me neutralizing it. One, two, three, four, five. He's got five countries now to my three. And I'm going to give Vietnam. I might actually UN Vietnam. Okay, it takes Burma. That makes sense. Let's get Truman back in the deck. I think I'll use IP War to take India. We'll see if he events blockade. If he events blockade, I will be looking very stupid with, with egg on my face. Um, but I just, I didn't want to hold all those ops. I've really, I, okay, Comic-Con, going to India. Nope. 
Okay, yep, that makes just as much sense. Okay, let's use the war here. Expect we'll see five year plan Middle East. AI war for the event. Okay, so he did have it. Okay, so both Asia and Middle East are coming out turn three. And I need to use both of these to stop his Dom, which I think is worth it. I would like to get into Libya here. Oh, Egypt is a great coup target. He could also redraw Nasser, but stopping Asia Dom seems really good. So let's do that. So my country's purpose is to help us move out. Okay. Of the dark chamber of here we go, turn three, and he get I get both scorings. He gets CIA. All right. So IP war down. He gets NATO. So I get I get both scorings. I get five year plan. Um. I get De Gaulle, and I get, okay, so those are my, and then we're going to re um, so we got CIA blockade, uh, NORAD, NATO, and SOC govs. So with two scoring cards in my hand, especially two known scoring cards in my hand, I think Middle East, as much as I'd love to head on five-year plan, um, given the SCIA, uh, I think Middle East is the right play here. So let's hope he did not redraw Nasser. Ouch. And he's got blockade too. Okay, that is painful. I don't have, I don't have anything to discard to that. So we'll see if he takes a coup here or if he reasserts Asia Dom. Or he's going to, oh, does not, he does not give CIA. Interesting. Okay. So he, he's going to take Asia Dom. All right. So. means I'm going to take a coup. <sighs> Hoping for a four in Argentina seems fine. Miss. Okay, so I'm getting dominated in Asia. Five VPs, that's gonna hurt. Blockade is gonna hurt as well. It's gonna really hurt if he read your decal here and is able to take Africa. He wants to give NORAD. Pressing priorities. I mean, I want to fill Mexico. I want a space too. Asia's not going to get any war. Well, I mean, he could have IP war, but. Yeah, let's just give up the scoring. So he's got CIA blockade, NATO sock govs is, is what I am, is what I, I think he's got. He could have duck is the issue. So 
Stock goes for the event. Doing what? It's going to go Italy. What are we going to do? Jam Italy? That's fine, let's do that. I'm gonna try and space both France cards if I can. Okay, no surprise there. We will not discard. Much I like to hold on to five year plan. None of these other cards are particularly playable at the moment. All right, there's NATO. And there's nothing I can do about that. Okay, that's nice at least. I think we're about to find out what his unknown card is. Oh, it's Europe. I'm surprised he jammed four into West Germany, given that he had Europe. He could have just scored it and moved on. Especially with Truman still around. Okay, I get decal. I also get special. Special may be my headline here. CMC stops a coup. Let's me walk into Nigeria. Yeah, maybe CMC is my headline. We've got some problem cars here. Just need to not see a oh boy Portuguese or uh, South African unrest would be a huge, huge problem for me here. Missile NB is going to hit Comic Con. That's not a huge issue for me. Okay. A little limited in terms of ops here. Not a great hand, but I, I am I'm happy at least that he does not have decal because uh, that would be a disaster for me. Also, I have NORAD in effect, so need to fill, fill up Canada. Oh boy, big old four up. What are we gonna do? Yep, good. Yep, that makes sense too. 
Okay, let's go. Uh, we got to take presence in Central, uh, and then let's go into Angola. I'd also like to get into Saharan, into Saharan states, but I got to take presence in Central. Having West Germany flipped on me hurts, but there was really ju there was just nothing I could do about it. Take Algeria here. Yep, I don't have the ops to fight that. Let's do this. I think if he had Portuguese or South African unrest, that's a much better headline than missile envy. So I, I don't think we're going to see it here. And I have I have hand problems here. Okay. Uh, maybe help me get uh, help me get Europe back if I can get uh, get the Pope invented. So I'm inclined to just score Africa here if he doesn't move into Tunisia. I really don't want to play you Surrey for ops. I would rather, much rather play it for the event. Okay. So he took Guatemala, Colombia, Saudi Arabia. I went into Saudi Arabia. Uh, I mean, I want to coup Colombia, but I don't know what I'm going to coup it with. I mean, special is an event. Usuri, probably also an event. If he had South America, he could just, he would just want to fill up Chile. Let's just score this. Okay, and then I got a space twice. Event. I'm just out of ops here. And now, if he event, if he scores central, then sure, I'll, I'll I, I can give up Fidel. Che, for what you're gonna? Okay, gonna do that. Yep. Okay, D call is unacceptable. And miss on the roll. Really would like to go ahead and just hit those three VPs and get them in my corner. Yep. Okay. Libs or Fidel? Which one's worse? I'll hold on to Fidel. Oh, come on, folks. Three shots at that 2VP slot, and I missed them all. Gunman. Yep, this is just good. All this is good for him. You know what? Special doesn't have to be a vet at this turn. Let's just get it. Let's get a coup in. Interesting. 
Okay. Let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. 14, going up to 14 VPs is nice, uh, but uh, the board doesn't look so great. Now he is holding on to CIA. He's still got it. Love to headline Bert the Turtle here. But he might headline We Will Bury. Ah, that's annoying. Okay, so he's now gonna space CIA. And he's got plenty of ops to do whatever it is he wants to do. Okay, what do you have? You're gonna. T so he, he's going to bully me in France and maybe threaten Europe control. But you know what? I'm not that worried about Europe control at the moment because NATO is in effect. So I need to bump Italy up to four. Need to bump Italy up to four, but not immediately. Let's let's get our real lines in on Mexico. See if we can get him out. Okay, got him out in one roll. Very helpful. This is at even. I want to take a shot here at even. Plus these are minus two. Let's take a shot at even. Okay, I missed on the roll. Not the end of the world. Annoying Sadat comes after. Uh, annoying Sadat comes before Nasser. But okay. All right, let's just get Italy up to four now. As a matter of fact, maybe even five because of Quagmire. Let's go Nigeria. I'm not really worried about, I'm just not worried about Europe control because NATO is in effect. Marshall was also evented, so he, so I'm in good position to take countries here. Again, dealing with a... Ah, that's annoying. That's annoying. I could flip it back, but I think a better use of my ops is to just... Uh, I mean, I could event nuclear subs. That is a, also a, a thing I could do. Nah, I... I don't think that's worth it. One here and one here is fine. I haven't seen any power cards yet. So 
Certainly has had effective headlines though. Decal, so turn one, I, I defected him, but decal, purge, missile envy, Brezhnev. Okay. Okay, so brush of Panama is good. Now I could take Cuba. I could take Cuba, get domination, but oh my god, another miss! Yep, gonna space OAS, but I still hold on to CIA. Weird. All right. Um. Hey, look at me. Fifteen VP lead is nice, but the board is so ugly. All right, and he gets three ops out of this. Let's do one, two, three, four. Let's make him repair Vietnam, even though I'm going to give it back to him. Yep, yep, I'm just going to take all of those back, which makes sense. And then, so I want to coup Colombia so I can at least get influence in South America. And then AR7, I'm going to play Panama. Three op coup of Colombia is a bit much, I know, but. Uruguay here? No. Okay. So, so breaking Panama is good, but it does not stop his south uh, his control in South America. I also want to get NORAD, but NORAD well NORAD would help me. So this that seems pretty good, but I mean you've got Junta Green. There's so many DEFCON degraders out there. Let's hold on to, let's do that. There's so many DEFCON degraders out there uh, and Quagmire is obviously still out there. I don't think I'm gonna be able to take advantage of NORAD here. So yes, and I, <laughs> sure enough, that does not work out well for me because I do not get, I do not get any of the DEFCON degraders and I do get Quagmire. Okay, what are we gonna do here? So I get Truman, but I, man, I, again, I, again, I just have no ops. All right, I think the, I, I don't know if I headline the ABM. Maybe I headline the Pope. Nixon is also good, but he could have cultural. Puppets, what's puppets going to do? Not really much at this stage. I think we hold on to him. He's probably got Junta. He's 
probably headlining it. Now he, now he also has CIA. Let's, let's headline the Pope. All right, so some bad scorings are going to come. Big four op coup where? Panama? Oh, Mexico. And he gets the roll. All right. Now what the heck do I do? I don't have anything better than a two-op to realign him with. And I don't have a three-op. I don't have a three-op. I, I, yeah, I, I don't have a three-op I can just take Panama with. So, okay, I will realign. All right, that's a disaster. I need up so bad here. Okay, central for minus two. It's not the worst. And he didn't want to. He didn't want to retake Panama. So Truman's interesting because it could. I could. I mean, I could just put ABM into Poland, and then I have Poland. But it doesn't. It doesn't change much in Europe. Nixon, I want to event, but I need the ops. I think one there. He's still holding on to CIA after all of this. Let's do this. Probably got South America. This board just doesn't look good. I don't have I any. Mean, he has three dominations to my zero. Even though I've got a 13 VP lead. 14 VP lead. Let's ABM coup Brazil. If I can get a big roll, Brazil's better. Even though that's a well. No, I mean I need a five for Brazil. I don't need a four for for Venezuela. I'd like to get something into Argentina too. Let's go Argentina. Disaster. Oh boy, there's China. Another miss, my God. Yep, that one just didn't have the ops. I would like to space Quagmire, but I wonder if holding it is better. It means I'm giving Nasser, though. I think I want to hold Nasser. Come on! Come on!
Come on with the space race. There's UN, and he gets rid of CIA. Finally gets rid of CIA. Okay. We need to take Libya. I need to see Kennedy next turn. I don't want to see Kennedy right now. Salt and Junta still around. Camp David, that one I'm happy to see. Let's get a domination on the board. For the first time, because the people of the world no want candy. peace, and the leaders of the world are afraid of war, the time are on the side of peace. But if he spaces Kennedy, I will be able to use salt. Let's go grain. No surprise there. Arms race. I mean, whatever I take, he's just going to take right back with Junta. Let's just do that. Okay. Alliance is useless. Um, now Yeah, let's do that. Let's jam North Korea. Okay, fine. Let him use a four. Let us now do this and flip that over.
Okay. So I wa really wanted to play Kennedy before AR7. He's got VOA. He's in a tough spot here, because I believe, yeah, he's got VOA. Spacing VOA. Okay. Yeah, we have not seen Kennedy. All right. Well, Southeast Asia's even, so I think we can safely score that. Get rid of both of these. Do I want to get rid of purge? Yeah, let's get rid of purge and keep and keep those. All right. Dump, dump. No, nope, I don't want to dump that. I want to dump that. Okay. And then... No, ah, jeez. One, two, three, done discarding. Okay, and then I think just this is good. Youth Japan's nice. Okay.
<sighs> I know I should I should have been realigning Mexico this whole time. <sighs> There he is. Okay. So I'd like to get rid of Nasser as well, but I don't think I don't take that chance. It's special. Okay. But surely one such lesson learned by the world at great cost. War games is nice. Unopposed becomes a contagious disease. Aldrich is a problem for me, but war games sure is nice. Um, let's do that. Good headline for him. <sighs> One, two, three, and four. Okay. Well, let's see if he also has central. Okay. All right. Well, that was fortunate for me. That could have gotten quite interesting. Whew. Okay. Well, good to get that win. Um, an interesting game, but uh, War Games helped me out, and you know I was able to just get those BP leads, and then yeah, the grain coupled with VOA and Kennedy turn seven let me dump South America was huge. So that was a big one. Um, very happy to get that win. He had, he had VOA and Kennedy and had to give me one or the other. So he decided to give me Kennedy. And uh, yeah, that was that was lucky because I, you know, just <laughs> scoring timing worked out well for me. The board is ugly. I've, he's got three dominations here um, to my two. And uh, the, the turn three purge when I was holding the scoring was bad. Um, ugh. But anyway, I will take the victory. I will be happy with the victory. And now I am going to eat some dinner. So thanks, everybody, for watching. Um, I know I'm, I'm sure the chat is going to be yelling at me to uh, that I need to realign Mexico because I had those realigns available and just didn't do it. But I uh, was kind of focused on other areas of the board. I also needed to take away Europe domination, and I didn't get around to doing that either. Um, so, you know, lots to... A lot to fix um, with this game, if I'm going to be honest. Um, lot, lot, lots to fix here. But, um, you know, I, I escaped with, uh, you know, the, with the, the scoring timings. And I played, uh, I, think, I think I played things right, um, you know, regarding how the, the scorings came. And 
feel good about the win. So uh, it improves me to 14 and two on the uh, ITSL season. And so, you know, a win's a win. So thanks everybody for watching. Uh, I will be back uh, actually on Wednesday over on Derek's channel. I'm going to be playing against Frank Zhang. Uh, Ted and Derek will be commenting on that one. So we hope, hope uh, you will join me over there. Uh, but until next time, this is Justin Abramson signing off. That was fun, but now it's done. So long, everybody.